Hello students, welcome back. Today I am going to explain about uh, Linux run levels. So when we talk about Linux run levels, run level means the running state in which uh, the Linux operating system is running. And when we talk about Linux run level, these are uh, total seven run levels, which are zero through six. So each level has their uh, different role. Like run level zero is used to halt the system. Run level one is a single user mode and so on. So in this uh, short chapter, I will be explaining now what these run levels are and how we can use different run levels under what scenario. And uh, when we talk about run level one, uh, so this is to power off the system. If you want to shut down your system, you simply uh, can use run level zero. So we can use it uh, with the init script like init zero. This will halt your system. Run level one is the single user mode. So where we also call it um, like rescue mode or maintenance mode. So that single user mode is actually run level one where we can do the maintenance to the system. We can fix issues. Then there is run level two. It is uh, the multi user mode. However, this is restricted. So the network interface card or network services and demons are not started here. So this is still uh, the restricted mode, but um, multiple users can still connect to uh, your system. Then we have uh, run level three, four and five. Uh, they are almost similar. So this is again the single user mode and uh, used during debugging systems, kernel issues or in your routine uh, uh, setup like day, any day to day activities you usually use uh, one of these modes. Uh, and mostly this is uh, run level five. And then the last here is run level six which is again to reboot the system. If you want to reboot your system, you can use uh, this run level six also. So that means by using init six. Now let's have a look practically. I will first use my Fedora VM and uh, let me go here. Let's get into terminal. So here, let's try to see the command to just quickly check is run level. I type in run level here, it is showing one and five. So that means one is actually a debug mode as we saw, or I explained to you before, but it is also text mode. And since this is text mode, so that's why it's showing one also. And five is uh, referring here to the graphical uh, mode. So multi-user graphical mode, like X window waste. So that is what it is referring to. Now, if I go back to our uh, here, we have another command uh, that is systemctl and let's try to get uh, the mode now with systemctl and then it is saying get default. So we do get default and you see here graphical target. So that means graphical mode is loaded um, and that is run level five. And we already saw that with the uh, run level command. And uh, if you want to see now the various run level libraries from where they are loaded, uh, then we can see that from the lib system D and then system. So let's do ls. I will do like this. I will go to library. And then we go to system. And here we do run level and let's look for uh, the run levels here uh, as per the targets and you see here these are the different uh, run levels uh, 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and uh, in fact they are even mentioned here power off rescue mode multi user target multi user target graphical target and reboot target so basically uh, from run level 2 till 4 uh, they are multi user uh, but yes, uh, we can define them uh, this way like that uh, two is not used. This is just user uh, definable. Then three is multi user text mode. Four is again user definable. We can set it as per our requirement. And then the five is full multi user graphical mode. So which is with X windows. Uh, so that means the screens, the graphical screen that we already see here. Uh, you can see here. This is graphical mode. So these are different modes and uh, we can try let's say i was explaining about let's say run level uh, one that is zero if i initialize it it should now halt the system so you see here i initialize it and then it powered on the system so it stopped my uh, system is now in a stop state 
with init 0 now let's just do a quick differentiation so i will now bring in uh, my another vm which is running debian linux and let's try to see as i explained earlier that most of linux distributions are same if you are familiar with one distribution you can work with multiple distribution so let's now try to see this quick difference here that how debian is different than rhel like system so we'll see uh, the run level how run level looks like here so let me get into this server i will log in into my user and then here is the terminal let's see what the run level are here so here it is so little bit difference now it's not showing one it's showing here n and five so that means it has loaded uh, run level number five and now if we do system ctl and then we use the same command again that is get default so i do get default and then we press enter so you see again this is showing almost same output that is graphical target now let's try to load list the libraries here system system d system and then let's try to list the targets here and you see here again almost same power off target rescue target multi-user target graphical target reboot target so all the run levels in these different distributions is also same we checked it in debian we checked it in uh, fedora which is red hat like inter, uh, operating system it's same now let's try here uh, in previous section we used uh, run level zero to halt the system now let's do it to reboot so that means we can use six and now it will not halt my system but it will just reboot my uh, vm you see here it is back to the login screen and now bootloader screen i mean and now it will bring us back to the login screen so this is how uh, the various run levels works in linux and uh, linux like systems uh, this was a brief overview i hope you liked it if you have any questions let me know and see you in the next chapter thank you